So today let's demystify the difference between an open model and an open source model. Now open model, it generally refers to a model that is accessible to public for use. You can download this model, use it for inference, make predictions with it, or even in some cases do fine tuning for a specific task. However, there might be restrictions on how you can use it. Now Google's Gemma model is an open model. Open source models, on the other hand, an open source model does not only just allow you to use the model, but also gives you access to the source code behind it. This means that you can understand how the model works, modify it to your needs, and even redistribute your modified version. This fosters collaboration and innovation, and as you, you, anyone can contribute to the development of these models. Now, Mistral AI has a series of open source models that you can check out. Here's, here's an analogy. Think of a restaurant recipe. An open recipe might just list the ingredients, while an open source recipe might provide you full access to the instructions, allowing you to experiment and create your own variations. There's an ongoing debate about what exactly constitutes an open model with some companies releasing models with limitations like restrictions on commercial use of these, uh, these models while still calling them open. For true open source models, look for those that adhere to established open source licenses. Subscribe and follow me for more such content.